Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of State of Decay 2 Homecoming. Alrighty, when we left off, we had tried to save this community here and unfortunately wasn't able to get there in time. Uh, so we took what we could. Uh, we still have stuff that we can pick up, but unfortunately I don't have the inventory space for it. But... We will be back soon. I'm going to mark that off for sure. But I do have a bounty I need to pick up from the bounty broker, so I'm going to go ahead and do just that. Head down a little further south to do that. And there's a feral, because of course there is. Okay. There we go. That was what I was hoping for. Okay. Woo, 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 woo. Too close to that bloater for comfort. Way too close. But we got it to explode. That's the important part. That is not the direction I need to go. Alright. And I hit a rock. Okay. Splendid start so far. Alright. There is the bounty broker. There we go. Alrighty. Down you go. Goodbye. Pick that up. And... Oh, I don't have the space to take your thing, do I? Probably don't. Alright, um... Pick that up. It's fine. Yeah, I expected that I wouldn't get back in time, but it's fine. Ammo is easy to come by nowadays. Especially since I have one on my back right now. Cash Beaumont. We chat for a bit? Yes, Let we us shall. See what's available, shall we? There we go. The Samurai SMG. Now ours. Zombie Horde is nothing more than a prime opportunity to efficiently dispatch large numbers of the undead. That's pretty heavy. Oh, you'll be fine. There we go. Got that. And is there any of these I can probably complete before the end of the month? Neither mine or other files. Hmm. Craft plague cures, scavenge for meds. Hmm. Wrench blade. That wouldn't be terrible. Hmm. Hmm. Plague cures would be easier to complete, but I don't need an assault pistol. Hmm. Hmm. Plan of action. Let's I go with. To it. See you again soon. Let's go with ammo because I'm pretty sure the uh, ammo I have in my bag counts as scavenged when I put it in my inventory. So, and by my inventory, I mean the base's inventory. So, shouldn't be that difficult. A lot of plague zombies around here. Oh, it's fine. It's a plague heart zone. What do you expect? There we go. Didn't get the one I wanted, but it's fine. Whee! Oh, boy. Okay. Well, it still works out. Just not as intended. Goodbye. Alrighty. Almost to our base. Uh, of course there's a feral. Of course there's a feral. Why wouldn't there be? And... There we go. 
final offer. Of course there is a fucking screamer right here. I swore too early. <laughs> I swore too early in the episode. Whoopsie doodle. Okay. Anyway. That's going to be a little bit of cut. <laughs> that is now ahead of me. Oh, I love it when I screw myself over like that. Okay. Okay. Drop, 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 drop. Now the real test is if it counts. Yep, that it does. Knew it. Okay. That one won't be too hard at all to complete then. Drop all of this. Especially that. Oh. Ashton's starting to get fatigued. Man. There we go. Hi, I'm back. How's everybody doing? Hell yeah. Alright, um... Not too bad. Oh, I have to improve it by close combat fighting, so I have to get rid of my machete to be able to do it. Man. Alright, well, it's fine. I'll just repair this and then put it away. There. Good. Um, okay. With that in mind, it is time to swap over. Oh, yeah, you're a hero now. I forgot. And even more influence gained. Alrighty. That ain't too bad. Jillian McQueen. Jilly Bean. Alright. Well, looks like Beto's back in action. Although, I, it looks like I have a new clothing option. I forgot to... Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot I got the uh, skink. <laughs> Sadly, the teeth are purely ornamental. That's unfortunate. Does not allow you to breathe under <laughs> Does not allow you to breathe water. Also, technically not a lizard. Salamanders aren't a lizard? Really? Iguana does not include the optional <laughs> dewlap attachment. The Anole lizard. Fun fact, the blue Anole is found only on a single island off the coast of Colombia. Someone really wanted to add that in. Someone really wanted to add that in. That was a fun fact that someone actually talked about in the office of Undead Labs multiple times to the point it had to be added in. Isn't that right? Am I right? Did I call that? Did I call that one? Okay, I probably called that one. Anyway, moving on. What the... <laughs> not what I gave you. What? <laughs> I mean, it's not a bad look. Maybe not for Beto, but I mean, it's not a bad look. <laughs> Actually, um, leather trench coat. Yeah, it isn't a bad look. Durable, stylish, immortal. Invented for war, perfected by fashion. It doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look that bad, actually. Yeah, doesn't look that bad at all. All right, time to switch over to Beto. Good to see you, kid. Yeah, good to see you too, Tom. Me, Tommy, and me. I guess that was how I was going to say that. Anyway, not the point. Point is, let's go ahead and grab. Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to grab. Get rid of that, maybe? And then grab some more? There we go. That's fine. Because... Yeah, no, that shouldn't be too bad. Shouldn't be too bad at all. Alright. So, the final offer. Meet with Petunia at Hold the... Hold on. I'll be there in a minute. The final offer. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's see what this final offer is about, huh? Let's go ahead and find out. 
We've been entertaining them long enough. This final offer better be something real special. All right. I inadvertently went the right route. I wasn't even sure if that was the right one or not, but it turns out it was. Goodbye. And I'm not sure about that one. Not entirely sure. But okay. Oh, hey there. Want to come in? Yeah. We finally accepted it. We don't have what it takes to live out here on our own. Can you take us in? Okay. I'll need to talk it over with my people first. I'll give you some time. Yeah, this is the apocalypse. Frying nice won't get us anywhere. <sighs> She's always such a downer now. Okay. You do have gardening. That's actually not bad. It's just you can't manage to make that work on your own. Can't promise That's anything. That's ridiculous. Petunia said that maybe we could come live with you. She asked the question. I haven't answered it yet. More bad news. I can't say I'm surprised. You'll be fine. Mm. You will be fine. Do I actually have the space, though? I have room for one. Although. Although. Echo Lab Research Station. The landmark outpost would allow us to have more beds. And all I need to do is clear out that plague heart. I honestly don't see why not. They're all possibly good Good enough. Okay. Well, my home is right there. Might as well just head on home, do the talk with Dawn, and then come back. Question is, would that be enough to make Dawn leave? Because I do know that that is a possibility. Some community members can leave if they don't like your decisions on some things. And I would rather not lose her. I mean, I did train her all up after the last few series. Alright. Worth a shot to find out, I guess. Dawn. I yeah. never thought I'd get along with folks like these, but here we are. Did Did it actually I guess the force field is down. Stop. Okay, he ended up killing the other zombie. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Okay. Someone help me. Ow. Ow. That hurt. That hurt. Ow. Okay, time to pop some painkillers. Ow. Okay. Okay, well, get some damage on him at least. Ow. Owie. That hurt. And down you go. Goodbye. 
tough negotiation and a hero. Beautiful. Well. <laughs> yeah, man, yesterday was okay, but today is actually good. <laughs> I mean, we did take down that jug pretty handily. So, yeah, I guess I guess you could say it's pretty good. I guess. There we go. That's good. Pop that in my inventory. In fact, you know what? Let's see. Could I make some more? That's not what I want. This is what I want. Six bottles of painkillers. Doesn't take all that much medicine. And in fact, we grow more than we end up spending. Sure. And we'll rebuild up what I just used in about two days. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad at all. Alright. Okay, Dawn. I need to talk to you. I need to tell you that being helpful like David wanted is the best way to honor a spirit. Not shunning everyone out. Whoops, that's not who I want. That's what I want. We're on the edge of survival here. We can't afford to take in people who can't take care of themselves. I just can't stomach turning them away. In another life, they could be us. Yeah, this is the apocalypse. Playing nice won't get us anywhere. She's still going to have problems with it. But it doesn't sound like she's going to leave outright if I take them in. So I guess we're going to take them in. And then I work on getting that landmark base taken care of. Well, hi there. Alright. Take care of you. And back up into all of you. And then... Take out all of you. And there's another horde, really. Does that even constitute a horde, really? Doesn't seem like they should. Good. Man, we have a lot of... <laughs> a lot of plague samples. Just outside our front door. And we back up to take out this horde again. There we go. And good enough. Barely even needed to have my door open for those. <laughs> yeah, more bodies is better than none. Plus, who knows, maybe the other ones are viable options for getting new skills. Who knows? They can't do it on their own, but perhaps with our guiding hand. Perhaps with our guiding hand. They can learn to be proper, useful members of our group. Come home with me now. You won't regret taking us in. I better not. I already have people pissed off that I'm thinking of you at all. Space for creativity enabled. Wait. Space for creativity. That was... In here. I have someone who has knowledge of the arts now. That's one of them. Taylor, Abby, and Petunia. Petunia apparently is injured. Self-sabotaging and a stoner. Uh. Okay, this explains why they were having so much trouble. Often the target, negative labor, negative standing rewards, and self-sabotaging. And her cardio is crap. Wow. Okay, that explains a bit. At least she's good at gardening. <laughs> That's the only upside to her stonerness. Okay. Abby... This flincher that impacts her ability to fight. A Zine author? Hmm. And a cashier. 
if you need someone to stand there and count things, I'm here for you. All right, that's fair. And worked on a farm, doomed, and asthma. And Dawn was herbalism, right? Yeah, it was herbalism. You probably won't believe this, but when I was a kid, I was obsessed with those silly kung fu movies. I used to stay up all night watching them, practicing to become a ninja. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Practicing to become a ninja, huh? Well. You notice the creeper, right? Oh, yeah. Hard for me not to. I was about to say, I knew I was going to completely avoid that rock. The amount of them that sometimes wastes medicine is unfortunate. You're welcome, Mina Sin. Thank you. Thank you. Like, seriously. Thanks. We're gonna need to uh, thin our population. And soon. I hate to say it, but he's not exactly wrong. This is the phrasing was not great, but Taylor, honestly, <laughs> Taylor is a warlord of all people. Oh, man. Doomed, sometimes wastes medicine. What was Abby's worst thing? Just bad at fighting. At least she's got shooting to make up for it. Honestly, Petunia is probably the worst off out of all of them. Lower stamina. Bad cardio. Maybe Dawn had a point. Out of all of them, really only one is salvageable. Hey, buddy. I almost missed you. This is really the only one who is salvageable. Funny enough. Okay. No weapons or nothing. Rats, you're still alive. Yeah. Yeah, I am. Take it easy. Uh, 
All right. Well. Let's take Taylor. Not going to equip her with much because, quite frankly, I'm not sure if she's going to be able to make it. But... Grab this backpack. And it's one I'm willing to lose. If at all. Um I guess the deck destroyer. Okay. You don't know me, but I'd appreciate it if you'd come and hear me out. Yeah? You say so, huh? Alrighty. That's what I wanted. This was the thing I wanted. Hang tight. On my way. Gracias. I just noticed that all of these cars were knocked out of the way due to, uh, the jug. So, time to fix that, I guess. Just slightly. Just ever so slightly. There we go. Good. <laughs> she is so screwed. I honestly do not have high hopes for Taylor here. Like at all. Main reason I'm equipping her lightly is because I'm not even sure if she's going to survive this little jaunt of ours. Quite frankly, I'm not sure she's going to survive much of anything. I need a break. Yeah, I know. I'm working on it. There we go. Well, didn't expect you to teleport, but here we are, and crap. Yes, it is. Greasy Automotive Magazine. This could actually be helpful if you ever find a car with the exact problems these issues, this issue covers. Eh. My dude. Okay, all right, that was terrible, just so you know. The Long Rangers killed my friend, and they have to pay. Can't take them down myself, oh boy. Sure. What are we standing around for? Why aren't we killing all of those assholes right now? Good. I feel bad. I feel bad, because Taylor's voice actress, I actually enjoy her accent, but... God damn, does Taylor herself, as a character, just absolutely suck. Like, look at the health and stamina bars. How the hell am I supposed to work with that? There is no way that I can. I mean... I need to rest. You'll be fine. Do you mind waiting a sec? I'm surprised that you're not following me. Okay, her fighting is actually okay. Fighting won't be too bad. It's just the cardio that will be screwed up. And that's just for Marasma. What in the fuck are you being stuck on? AI today, man. AI. I'm well aware. Better finish it off. Absolutely. Alright. Come on. Let's get going. She somehow manages to survive this whole jaunt. I will be surprised. 
if not impressed. Although, her ability to survive will probably be due to my own skill as opposed to <laughs> her abilities. Alright. Oh, hi there. Goodbye. Nisei is helping spread some good cheer. Good. Fantastic. Yo. Hebram, come on. Help me out here. Oh, now you show up. Alright. Uh, of course it's a horde. Let's run away from them as soon as possible. There is a car that I could let you use. This is Rames over there, I mean. It's the best opportunity as any. Okay. Hebrum is going to take his time getting over to me, but that's fine. Because, quite frankly, he seems to have his own goofy AI problems today. Don't know what it is. <laughs> Goodbye. Wow, that was, that was a hell of a hit. All right. And that is a hell of a horde. I'm going to try to avoid. All righty. You are you running straight into the horde? Hold up for a bit. Oh boy. I would be able to hold up if you actually kept pace, but you can't seem to even do that. Alright. Goodbye to you. Squeeze through here. Good. And take you out. All right. And of course, they're near where I want to go. But for a completely different reason. Of course. Of course. Is that that is. Alrighty. Okay. And I can't go further than this. Wow. Okay. That, I don't know what I expected, but it sure as hell wasn't that. <laughs> well, it's something. Yeah, it is something. <laughs> the fact it's still happening even after I walked away. Great noise brought him right to me. Yeah, probably, but it's fine. <laughs> I think they'll be more distracted by him than anything else. And now I'm stuck in... Are you for real? Okay. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's do the stuck.
There we go. Um. Uh. <laughs> I'm now more stuck than when I stopped. <laughs> what? I can't even access my community or anything. <laughs> okay. There we go. <laughs> that was the weirdest bug. <laughs> the noises he's making. Okay. All right. I'm at the end of the episode early. <laughs> Because something is broken. I don't know what it is, but something is broken. Um, <laughs> I guess we're not going to help him. <laughs> and I guess we're going to have to see if Taylor survives on her own merits at any other time in any other place. Because <laughs> so far... Oh, look, I found a thing. Ah, you did find a thing. Look at that. Uh... Either time, it seems that everything wants to be broken. So, just to avoid having that noise still playing in the background, I'm just going to pause it and I'm going to end the episode. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, I can't even be mad because it's the funniest bugs I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> although someone please please send undead labs these clips because wow <laughs> just fucking wow okay um because as funny as they are <laughs> it still needs to get addressed but holy fuck my dude <laughs> holy tits all right. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and these fucking hilarious bugs. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and <laughs> trying to help communities nearby and our newest members. And uh, <laughs> see if... Maybe we can get them to a semblance of competency. <laughs> but so far, things are popping up making that a little difficult. Just a little bit. But we'll see how it goes. Hopefully soon. And uh, hopefully without any more crippling bugs like that. Funny as they are, it is kind of detracting from the gameplay so here's hoping it gets fixed soon for me and for you